I'll tell you, I was afforded the opportunity by General Hale to come out and talk about Project Athena. Just the benefits of being completely honest on your assessments and producing a good IDP, uh, which enforces the Army people's strategy of a career of uh, lifelong assessments. And Project Athena is a self-based assessment, a battery of assessments that give us insight into our developmental needs, our strengths, and through the Leader 180 and Leader 360 into our blind spots. These are all self-assessments. The information and the, the end states of all these are owned by the individual. Nobody else can see, nobody else can get to this information. So what it does is it provides that individual based off of knowledge, skills, and attributes, or knowledge, skills, and behaviors of, at grade and echelon of what we think an individual needs to be capable of doing and possession to be successful. It gives us the end point. Through these assessments, we figure out where they are currently, or they figure out where they are currently. And then through multitudes of tools that we have and resources, we start to close those weaknesses, we reinforce their strengths, and we identify some blind spots that they need to be aware of, of how they interact uh, and how they get the results uh, that they, they're required to get. Right now, it's, it's instituted in all cohorts. We are FOC, fully operational capable, in our Bullocks, in our Triple Cs, CGSOC, which is the Majors Education, Intermediate Level Education, is uh, initial operating capable, so they started this month uh, taking these assessments. Our NCOs at the BLC and ALC, Advanced Leader Basic and Advanced Leader Education, at their initial operating capability, so they've started taking them. Our warrant officers have started taking them, and our civilians will start taking them in July. This is all about the individual. This information is owned by them. It's CAC-enabled on the Army Enterprise Assessment Server. Uh, there is no reason to be scared uh, to share this information with your counselor. This is all about the individual being as good as they need to be to lead our soldiers. I'm not going to lie, I was a little skeptical at first when we were taking these tests. Well, not a lot of information about them. Uh, I'm sure most of my class felt the same way. Just told, hey, you're going to take a bunch of batteries of assessments about how this is going to go. And you're like, okay, this just seems like a scheme to get to see what we think about. And the Army's going to use this to analyze us. But, I mean, I was definitely convinced in there. Um, I am a little ashamed that I didn't take them quite as seriously at first, but I will definitely say in the next few assessments, I'll, de I'll be taking them a little more seriously. So I, I encourage everyone, share the information that you're comfortable with, take the assessment serious, and then put in the effort on the back side of it, because we need everybody we're bringing in the Army to be as good as they possibly can be.